Discussion on Carabello sign or effect in severe aortic stenosis on cardiac catheterization. Blaise A. Carabello and colleagues described the Carabello effect as the change in arterial pressure when the catheter is pulled back from the left ventricle to aorta in severe aortic stenosis. When the catheter tip is in the left ventricle in severe aortic stenosis, usually with valve area less than 0.5 square centimeter, the catheter itself enhances the obstruction across the aortic valve. This leads to a fall in the aortic pressure measured by another catheter. A simplified method is to connect the side arm of the femoral arterial sheath to a pressure transducer. But if the catheter and sheath are of same size, the pressure tracing would be damped. For a good femoral pressure tracing, the sheath should be at least one French size larger than the catheter. When the catheter is pulled out from the LV, the aortic pressure or femoral arterial pressure if the sidearm pressure is being monitored rises due to the relief of the further obstruction in critical AS which was caused by the catheter across the aortic valve. This phenomenon which occurs in critical aortic stenosis has been called the Carabello sign or effect. Carabello himself has opined in an editorial in circulation that this effect is seldom observed these days. He attributes it to the change in pattern of aortic stenosis. 40 years ago, when the sign was described, AS was more often rheumatic or congenital in etiology. Doppler echocardiography was not available then and severe AS used to be documented only at cardiac catheterization. Now the most common etiology is atherosclerotic AS occurring at a later age group and the documentation is much earlier at lesser grades of severity due to widespread use of Doppler echocardiography. Hence, even if most cases of severe AS are catheterized with NRF catheter into the LV in the current era, Carabello sign is less likely to be observed because most severe AS would undergo definitive treatment before they become so critical as to produce the Carabello sign. In the original report by Carabello, this effect was noted in 75% of those with aortic valve area of 0.6 square centimeter. A rise in pressure of 5 millimeters of mercury was considered as a positive Carabello sign. The sign was absent in those with aortic valve area of 0.7 square centimeter. Here are a couple of articles by Carabello on the sign named after him. Thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe, like, share and post your valuable comment below this video.